Right outside when we can start to see a lot of devastation, a lot of trees on people's houses. Uh, we're starting to see roads washed out. Uh, Going to South Carolina? Uh, okay. I see the bridge on the other side. Yeah, we ain't getting through there, man. There's no way. Shut her up. So we're blocked down here, we can't get through. Hey fellas, everything okay here? We're doing fine, sir, we're thank you. Good, sir. Okay, well we'll go ahead and turn around. <laughs> <laughs> What's in here, food? <laughs> Dang. Right like a lot of food here.
Oh god, they got face masks. Josh Bradley. Josh, you tell me anybody that's been coming in and getting stuff? Or? Mainly just locals right now. Um, the biggest demand right now, it seems to be some food, cleaning supplies, okay. for parks. Good deal. Appreciate it, man. No problem. Thanks, Thanks a lot, man. Brenton's Neck, South Carolina, outside of Conway, right? Uh -huh. um, her house is already almost under. Well, it, the water's coming around it. So it's by Sunday, you think it's going to be? It's going to be all up under it. We're praying that it doesn't go in it. You had the other hurricane that come through here that did completely. Um, Matthew came in two years ago and came up uh, 17 inches in our house, 15 inches in the church. Mm. Um, and then we, like I said, the house burnt down a month after that, whenever they turned the power back on. And really? so we built and built up um, so some that's, more. Yeah, and so right now we're seeing the church that she's talking about. <laughs> 